Anatomy. Like the old days, we weren't sure if you tore the meniscus, you couldn't see the posterior meniscus, so you take the whole meniscus out. Well, now we can see all the way the back with an arthroscope, we go all the way back and see if there's a tear back there. And certain small tears you can actually repair now, which we couldn't do before. So we're getting better and better at handling how these things. Same thing with shoulder surgery. They, 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 they can do these big these plugs and sutures in there. That are, so I think it's just the evolution of make it better, uh, cheaper. And, and I'm not meaning to say it's expensive, but you can do these as outpatients safely. Or if you do an outpatient next surgery, it was not done because of the insurance. There was no reason to stay in the hospital. So the only ones that people had to stay with the implants were Medicare, because you could implant in Medicare, they have to stay overnight. And they could go home the next morning at six o'clock. So I would say that it's just a better understanding of anatomy, better equipment we can use to, to take care of these problems and, and be less, less invasive.